Hey folks, how y'all doing? Welcome back and down in the shop. Yeah, I, I tell you what, folks, after one of my last videos of a cordless drill, I said, boy, I really need some more cordless drill storage. And I, was, I said, you know what, you should build something because you have the capability of doing that. And it's just scrap wood. It's, it's, and I said, well, you know, let's, let's see what's on Amazon. So I looked at Amazon and I found this metal one for 25 bucks each. And I'm like, holy cow, that's, you know what, I'm going to get that because I think a lot of people might be interested in that. So we're going to take a look at that on, on Amazon. I'm going to show you what I took to install, although you can see it wasn't much. And, and then just, uh, you know, talk about how heavy duty it is because... I'm shocked on how heavy duty this is huh, for 25 bucks. Yeah, like I said, I couldn't pass this up when I saw it. I said, why build one when you can buy one for 25 bucks? And it's not plastic, it's metal. I mean, you, you could easily make these. Yeah, if it's scrap wood, it's, it's free and it's just your time. But a lot of us don't have that. So, you know, getting something that's inexpensive, that takes three screws to put up. I mean, if I can do it, I mean, so can you. You can see there's the dimensions. It, it holds four drills. It's made out of uh, metal. Uh, they're saying it's a heavy-duty uh, paint on there that's resistant. It'll have a 12-month warranty, although I'm not really sure what warranty against what. There isn't a whole lot here, folks, but it's practical and it works. Uh, let's take a closer look at it. All right, so here it is. And the, the, the first thing that impressed me was that's some pretty thick metal there. And you can see they got some gussets in there to strengthen it up. And it's got all these little slotted holes you can put stuff in. Um, there are a couple things though that you need to know about it. Number one, you see that that's not a right angle right there. So if you install it the way it's meant to, it's gonna angle down here. I'll, sh I'll show you what I'm talking about. All right, so if you install it, and maybe some people like this, it automatically angles down. So like, you know, if I do some sanding up here or something like that, the vibration I think would take them off. So uh, I was gonna flip it over, but uh, I didn't really care for the way that worked and then it left some sharper edges so what i did was i just put and you can see it right there i put a shim a pressure treated shim underneath to get this up so that it's uh it's just a little bit shy of level on the upside so even if there's vibration in the table there the drill shouldn't come out but that's the only thing that i found that's wrong with it other than that uh, i got absolutely no problems with it whatsoever and like i said you could always install it this way and then it would it definitely would be facing up. Um, I would probably maybe drill a hole or two, maybe two holes in there, just to give it a little bit more oomph. But when you hang it like this, it's got it's got plenty of oomph, as you can see. Some pretty thick metal, and I I don't know if these are um, discounted because of that, but uh, for twenty five bucks, I mean. You know, the movement that's there is that piece of plywood I put back there. But I'll tell you what, haha, <laughs> guess what? I got room for more drills right there. All right, folks, I hope this was helpful. Tom Horseman on YouTube. I'll leave the link down below to this thing. Um, made in China, and there's what it says it is. Cordless Power Tool Organizer, made of heavy-duty alloy steel. Alloy steel. So leave the link down below. Tom Horseman on YouTube. Thumbs up. Leave a comment. And as always, thanks for watching.